and there's nothing that's been so full of adrenaline and so rewarding as as the work that I feel I'm coming with mobile metrics. It's married everything from my background, if you will, the finance with the, the market research with the technology into an output that, you know, is hopefully making a difference. Mobile Metrics is a market research company that collects demographic data about low-income populations in developing countries. I grew up on a farm in the Midwest, in the middle of Missouri. I went to St. Louis to college and to Washington University. After college, I, I joined the Peace Corps. I ended up being in Togo, West Africa for two years. I lived amongst the invisible population and realizing that we knew nothing about these thousands and thousands and thousands of people that were surrounding us. The professional discipline working at that institution was phenomenal. You know, I couldn't imagine a better place to have cut my teeth, right? Having said that, that memory of the Peace Corps and that experience always was there. I just drank the Kool-Aid on the power of technology and, and how it can really narrow the divide between the haves and the have-nots. I started realizing what was really important. To me, it was the international, it was the travel, it was the development work. I started realizing, well, what I do know is technology. I do, you know, research, da da da, da. And this is where, you know, I am alive. How can I blend it? Right? There's seven billion people in the world, and there's about four billion we have no information about. That's over 50% that we can't even drill down to give you a profile of how many kids are in their family and levels of education and health conditions. Yet so much of foundation money, corporate uh, money, nonprofit resources are allocated based on faulty numbers. What ecosystem could be put in place to really get at that? Mobile Metrics is a market research company that collects demographic data about low-income communities in developing countries. And how we do that is by hiring local youth who go door to door in their own communities using handheld devices to collect that information. That information is then being used by governments and multinational corporations to better identify and understand what the greatest social needs are, what, the, what are the greatest needs for products and services. We have about 6,000 data points. We've hired and trained 50 mobile agents in the field. Obviously the vision is to take this to, to every developing country. I mean, we've got a long way to go. So it's a matter of you know, finding you know, partners that can help replicate the model in other countries as well and maintain the, the quality of the data. We start reaching out to people who work in that area, you know, who are experts in that area, to start talking to them to get an idea, to really find out again, is this, is this really an issue? Is it something that you know, resonates still with you? Does it, and then you start getting birds of a feather around you. And before long, if you're all you know, interested in the same problem, chances are, popcorn is going to go off and ideas are going to fly and you're going to start coming up with solutions that are phenomenal. I think for sure it's uh, the community and the mobile agents. They're starting to, to get to know more about their own communities and being a voice and that empowers me so much to see this happen and to see it growing and to see it whether it be in data but also you know their own voices getting out in the world. Um, that's just so cool.